Many shelters in the U.S. won't take out black cats because they fear people will just want them for Halloween. Every year around Halloween, we dress up in eerie attire and decorate our homes with spookily decorative items. But have you ever pondered why Halloween brings out black cats or why we dress up as them on this day? The strange, fuzzy animals have a significant historical significance and have come to be associated with witchcraft. But from where did this originate? And what distinguishes a black cat from other cats? Why are black cats displayed at Halloween? Every year on October 31st, we employ black cats as part of our Halloween decorations to decorate our homes. This is primarily due to their reputation for superstition. Given that Halloween is known for its window to the dead, many individuals have begun to adorn their homes with objects connected to superstition and witchcraft in recent years. The intention was to frighten away any evil spirits that might be there by exhibiting ominous materials. It is believed that keeping a black cat on display will safeguard the home. This is how the Halloween symbolism of black cats came about. Why is witchcraft related with black cats? Black cats were believed to bring bad luck and superstition throughout medieval Europe. Due to their affiliation, they made the ideal ally for any witch looking to curse you. Additionally, it was thought that witches would change into black cats, similar to how vampires change into bats. The Puritan pilgrims from the Plymouth colony are credited with starting the relationship between black cats and the U.S. The Puritans introduced their fear of magic and witchcraft to the United States. Burning a black cat on Shrove Tuesday has become customary in order to ensure that there won't be any house fires that year. Many shelters in the U.S. refuse to take out black cats because they are concerned that people will just buy them for Halloween. Black cats, are they unlucky? Black cats have a variety of meanings around the world, and not all of them are negative. Black cats in particular were worshipped and revered by the ancient Egyptians as gods. Black cats are revered as a representation of Cupid in Japan. They think owning a black cat increases your chances of finding love. But during the Middle Ages, cats were considered unlucky and cursed in France and Spain. If a black cat crossed your path from left to right in medieval Germany, it was thought that you would be cursed. A black cat reclining on a sick person's bed will cause them to pass away, according to another urban legend, while turning your back on a black cat will curse you, according to another. These folk tales and superstitions have persisted and served as the foundation for our mysterious relationships with black cats. Are black cats enchanted? Black cats are frequently seen as being mystical and capable of taking on several forms. Black cats, specifically, are said to have the ability to change into witches. The majority of these correlations have their roots in pop culture, although some are actually caused by natural occurrences. Black cats, for instance, can alter their color. Although the black tabby cat appears black, it may actually have what is referred to as a stripe pattern underneath its fur. This can only be seen after a cat has spent days sitting in the sun. The fur will seem rusty brown with some stripes when the sun lightens it. Similar to how our hair will become lighter if we are exposed to more sunlight, sunlight alters the pigment in fur. Which black cat is the most well known? Since the early to mid 1900s, black cats have appeared in horror films, television shows, and comic books. The Black Cat, released in 1934, Tales of Terror, released in 1962, and The Legend of Hell House, released in 1973 are a few of the early black cat horror films. But Salem Saber Hagen from the Sabrina the Teenage Witch series is among the most well-known black cat figures. According to the legend of Salem, he disobeyed the town's chief witch in a fictional American town and as a punishment, the witch's council sentenced him to a 100-year life as a cat. In 1962, he made his comic book debut, but as his persona evolved over time, he rose to fame as Sabrina's sidekick. This is only one of several black cats who coexist with witches in fiction. The notion that black cats are mystical beings has been greatly influenced by these tales. Black cats have been linked to enigmatism and distrust for centuries. They are described in mythology from all across the world as being the sidekicks of witches and having the power to curse anyone who gets in their way. These concepts have been used by popular culture, which has solidified the black cat's status as a Halloween icon. It is believed that displaying a black cat around Halloween will protect the home. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.